Hello, hello, welcome back to another Monday. Um, went ahead, got my fries ordered this time. They actually got everything. Although, well, okay, they almost got everything. Um, I ordered like a 29 ounce can of peaches. They apparently tried to only give me a 15 ounce. The peaches are also supposed to be in water, not heavy syrup, but it's fine. We can just strain them in a strainer and rinse off the syrup. Um, they, luckily though, this time I did, like, put all my food from their, like, paper bags that they use into my reusable bags, just because my reusable bags have handles, so it's easier for me to actually carry them in the house. Um, and so I noticed the peaches, called them back, and then the manager brought out an extra three cans of peaches. So I guess, hey, now we got extra peaches, so not complaining basically four cans of peaches for two dollars fifty cents for a can of peaches i can't complain but all right i will get you turned around here we will look at the meal plan for this week um it's kind of a simple one a lot of stuff that jason's just going to be making this week because i have to work all week um i have to work tuesday through friday every day so yeah all right let's get you turned around here all right, give you guys a quick overview, and then I will show you our meal plan. I guess that there's not a lot. Uh, Midweek, I did end up going and doing like a big kind of like fruit and veggie stock up a little bit. Um, so there's that. Uh, meal plan today. I had a bunch of rewards for Pizza Hut, so tonight we are having Pizza Hut for supper. I'm picking up a couple um, pizzas that I use rewards points for and some wings. I also have some stuffed garlic knot things that have been in my freezer forever. Well, not forever, at least a few months. But, um, so I'm gonna go ahead, I'll make those um, here at about 4.30 because I gotta pick up the order at five. So I'll make those. I'm going to do, I'm going to heat those up in our own oven, and I might go ahead and make some brownies as well. And that's going to be about it. Um, tomorrow is my birthday. Woo! I get to be a whole 27 years old tomorrow. Um, so I wanted chicken rice. Um, so we're having that, because I figured that's what I want. Jason can make it, so that's what we're having. Wednesday is spaghetti with garlic bread and salad. We have stuff for spaghetti. I have sauce. I have hamburger meat that needs um, cooked and ate up, so that's what we're doing Wednesday because um, that's something that I can get thrown together pretty quickly. Um, let's see here. Thursday, corn dogs, fruit, which is going to be the peaches, and some chips for the kids. So I'm quick and easy for Jason to make up. Egg sandwiches and some chips on Friday. Um, and then some ribs, mac and cheese, and carrots on Saturday since I won't, since I'll finally be off work for a little bit, hopefully. Um, and then Sunday... We're going to eat up the pork loin that we got from last week, some mashed potatoes, um, and cans of green beans. So I already have carrots, by the way, in my fridge that need ate up. That was one of the things that I bought during the uh, veggie stock up. So let's get into it. We've got the four cans here of the peaches. The two cans of green beans for those for that pork loin there on the fifth. The can of mixed vegetables that goes in our chicken rice for tomorrow, plus the two bags of yellow rice. And by the way, if you guys not have not tried this up, this is amazing. Oh, so good. Um, also went ahead and got some of these Chompies onion bagels, some pre-sliced plain bagels. Just to have Jason and I have been into like having bagel sandwiches. Um, here's some garlic bread for that spaghetti and garlic bread. And the corn dogs. Which I thought I ordered the all beef ones. Or maybe these are all beef. I don't know. I'll have to go back and look at my grocery order. 
But anyway, um, it's fine. Even if they're not the old beef, I don't even care. I'm not going back for hot, for corn dogs. The kids will eat them either way. They don't care. Um, some ribs for the ribs, mac and cheese, and carrots. This will actually get put in the freezer immediately. Um, I cook mine from frozen at like, I want to say it's like 275 or something like that for hours. I just wrap it up in aluminum foil, stick it in the oven, and just cook it for like six hours. And then at the end, I brush on some barbecue sauce, put it under the broiler. Comes out perfect every single time. I'm not messing with that method. It, if it ain't broke, you don't fix it. Two things of American cheese slices, because we were running out. I ordered the Kroger brand of these cheddar cheese slices, but apparently they was out, so they gave me the Sargento anyway, which is fine. I like the Sargento too. There's a bag of chips, which we do have plenty of chips. I did have to do kind of a chip stock up, because the kids really like um, cheese puffs, and I just realized like all month they haven't had cheese puffs. So I went to the store yesterday, got them a couple Lunchables to have for today for lunch as a treat, and some Cheetos cheese puffs also as a treat. Um, stocked up on some cookies, because, I mean, who doesn't need cookies in their life? And some more of the regular cream cheese spread because we're about out of the regular and then I just was about to open up the my whipped one but Jason prefers the regular. Pop tarts, um, cookies and two of the cookies and cream, two of the chocolate fudge, and two of the s'mores. Half the time we have really busy mornings and we also have we need to get out of the house mornings so something convenient they can carry with them. It's kind of hard to carry around like eggs. Just saying. They have, they'll have some fruit and stuff with it. It's balanced. Some thick cut bacon. I love this bar of thick cut bacon. I mean it's a decent deal and it's just, I don't know, it's amazing. I, I prefer the thick cut. Um, does really good in the oven. Two things of orange juice. These are on sale I think for like I want to say it was like a dollar, maybe it was two dollars a jug, um, still not a bad price either way. Um, two more things of milk, I did also have to get a gallon of milk last night because we, were, we weren't going to have enough to get for cereal this morning um, before I went to the store for our pickup order. Here's the potatoes to do the mashed potatoes. Um, I still have some like a pound and a half of the tinier gold potatoes sitting over there so these plus that will be a perfect amount to do our mashed potatoes when I do the pork loin. I also got two tomatoes just to slice up for like sandwiches and stuff and to put in salads this week um, and then I also got a thing of lettuce and I have another thing of lettuce also in the fridge for us to eat up this week and then there's the Caesar salad kit that we've been loving to go with our spaghetti Alrighty, so here's one last overhaul. Total came to $90 and some change. I'll put the total in the description below. You guys have a good day.